living good. I've been living good. Rolling through my hood. Understood. Just a young and in this bitch up to no good. What is up? Welcome to a new video. We are on episode 25 of the Road Max Skiller. So about 30 minutes ago, I would say I got 120 wood cutting, so I'm still pretty excited about that. And then also I just finished up the Crystal Geo loop from video. So if you guys didn't watch that video, I'm gonna have an annotation in the top right corner of the eye to show you the the price track of that. I'm not gonna do a price track of this, but here's like the quick overview. I'm gonna keep the gems because I'm gonna be crafting them and getting maybe like a couple crafting levels from that. I don't think I can do the Dragonstone, which I'm not really too worried about. I'll just sell those, but that's the loop from 1000 Crystal Geodes. And then right now, I am going to be doing a herb run and just because I have 2.9 mil, so I literally have no money to do anything right now. I already had herbs planted from like maybe like five months ago, so I got 40 inventos right there from the herb trip. All of them survived, which is a good thing, but like I said previously, inventos aren't that good at, as profit anymore, only 100k from that trip. I have the toad flax planted now, and I am just going to be waiting for the rest of the toad flax seeds to sell. So currently, since I have all these gems, I'm just going to craft them, maybe get a couple levels. I'm not too worried about using a crafting portable just because I don't have a huge supply of crafting stuff. So let's see how many levels I, I do get from the gems. 61 crafting. And keep in mind, I'm going to change my mind a shit ton throughout my uh, clips and stuff. Previous clip, like three minutes ago, I said I wasn't going to go to the portable because I thought, you know not going to be like a huge difference and here I am I'm at a crafter I uh I didn't know that I could craft dragon stones which was like the the determining factor that I'm going to go to the portables and get a little bit more xp so let's see if we can get maybe to like 63 or 64 64 crafting I won't be able to get to 65 I have about 98 diamonds left and then 63 dragon stones so I'll probably be like halfway until 65 with the gems I have Done with crafting all the gems, I am 18k until 65, so I am a little bit halfway until 65, so I'll do a price check on all of them right now, and when they were uncut, they were 3.3 mil, I believe, in the price check, so right now they are now 2 mil, so I did lose 1.3 mil, I'm not really too worried about that. About to get 72 Hunter, I am currently doing a Jack of Trades run real quick, so it's been quite a while since my last Jack of Trades run. For Slayer at least. Yesterday I did one for woodcutting, but I'm gonna continue doing a lot of Jack of Trades for my Slayer. I really want to get it to 80 just because it'll look pretty cool on a skiller. But then obviously after 80, I'll continue doing it up until 99. Look at this outfit. I uh was organizing my bank and I realized that I had the full ice warrior outfit. I didn't realize that for the longest time, and it looks so bad with my woodcutting cape. So I really do need a new outfit. I don't know what to get. So if you guys do have any suggestions, you can let me know in the comments what will look good with my cape. Done with my second cash of the day, and I do get 74 divination. So I'm gonna head to uh, Birth up and gonna wait out for the sinkhole. 105 mil in fire making. I am just kind of fire making just to pass the time since I am waiting for sinkholes and then my final cash of the day. Current plans right now is to get my smithing up to 80, my crafting up to 80, and same thing with divination. So I really want to unlock the invention skills. So I need to get those skills up to 80 and all I'm gonna do for the meantime right now is just use my protean bars and then also my protean hides. So I'm gonna be hopping worlds with the portables friends chat to find some portables obviously. And while I train I guess I'm just gonna watch the toxic chat because there's always that one person that's always talking shit at these portable locations. But uh, yeah, let's see how many levels I do get with the 400 bars that I have and I also have like 57k bonus XP. Always an argument at portables and people currently are complaining about tier 92 and tier 90 weapons and which one is better and like which one's more worth it. <laughs> so fucking annoying. Oh my god. 65 smithing right there so I think I might be able to get to 68 with the remaining bars that I have. Okay well I, I can only get 67 kind of uh, guessed the level around right there so I'm gonna be done with smithing because I don't want to spend money on it right now since I'm so poor. I'm gonna go on to crafting now. There's 65 so I'll probably maybe get 67 if I had to guess with the protean hides that I have. 67 crafting as well. I'm done using the protean hides. Just gonna save those for later on. 
and uh, I'm gonna just do herb runs for the rest of the of the day because I am pretty tired. This is how many total flex I have so far for my herb runs, and then um, I'm just gonna do a price check real quick for them. See how much they are. 1.8 mil in total. These are rising like every single day, so won't be surprised if they go up to like maybe 5.2k. Starting off today with a divination level of 75, 102k until 76. 73 dungeoneering, so I am done with sinkholes and cash today. I am going to grind out 70 crafting and then also 70 smithing. Going to sell my herbs from my uh, farming trips real quick because I need to get some more money before I do train my crafting and smithing. So sell the toad flax first and my dog is trying to get on top of <laughs> Stop. Rudy, I'm recording a video. Ow. Ow. He likes to like lay on my lap for some reason. He's like too big to lay on my lap. Get down, Rudy. <laughs> Stop it. Okay, ready. Okay, well, I'm gonna keep that in the video just because. And then my uh, Amatos, and then I'm up to 6.8 mil now, so I'm gonna continue doing herb rounds and shit because I need the money. 70 crafting, rest in peace, my uh, coin pouch, only 943k left, so I don't know if I can do a smithing just yet. I'll just have to kind of look up and see what methods I can do. Done with smithing, we are now 70, and. Uh, I want to sell my supplies to see how much money I did lose so far. So what I made is not selling currently. I did sell 408 of them for mid price. So we're going to collect that and then sell the remaining mithril bars. So I'm going to keep these in the, the grand exchange. I put one in for uh, 1 GP and they sold for 1K. So I'm going to just keep it here. I'm not going to go as low as 1K to sell these instantly. So that's going to be it for this episode. Got 70 crafting and smithing. So hopefully in the next episode, I'll be able to get AD in divination, crafting, and smithing so I can start invention. So if you guys did enjoy this skill or progress video, make sure to leave a like on the video. Subscribe for more, and I will see you in the next video. Peace.